You've seen it everywhere from gas to groceries to rent and electricity. Prices are going up on everything, but it's not stopping consumers from dropping that cash. Not in your size, Perla Shaheen has more on how Tucsonans are spending more than expected. It's not a drastic amount of money. It's 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 just enough to so you notice it. Tucson business owners have raised their prices in recent months because of supply chain issues and inflation. About a buck and a quarter, I would say, on most stuff to try to make up for the difference in the uh, uh, food cost. Mark Maybon is a co-owner of Cereal Grillers on Speedway. He says despite higher costs, some Cereal Grillers locations saw a 10% increase in customers this year. Since the beginning of January, things have changed drastically. I mean, it seems like people are getting a little more, uh, they feel more comfortable to come out to the restaurants and eat. It's not only in Tucson, more people are spending money across the United States. According to the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics, consumer spending went up by 2.1 percent in January. That's a jump from the 0.8 percent decrease in December. We like to go out to eat and we're not going to give that part of our, our, our lifestyle up. Dr. George Hammond at the University of Arizona attributes this trend to a number of changes. During the pandemic, we just weren't spending uh, on travel and tourism related services like we normally would. So that left more money in many individuals, and many households, bank accounts, and now they're spending it. Hammond says the trend might not continue for long. The high costs will soon take their toll on consumers' wallets. Rising prices uh, will counteract some of the increase in spending as it you know, eats up the, the household budget. Perla Shaheen, KGUN 9, on your side.